Hey guys, and welcome back to yet another Miss Pandara. Pandara? Pandara? Okay. Okay then. Pandaland video. You know, Pandaria. Okay, so it's pretty late. It's like 1 a.m. It's Wednesday now, and we're actually able to raid now. And so I'm gonna show you what I've been doing lately. I've been, f like everyone else, I've been farming dailies. Uh, reputation, fucking grinding heroics for items that never drop, yeah, uh, and shit like that. But um, before I show what I, what I really want to show you guys, uh, I just want to show you a really cool trick. Is that if you want to get your reputation up when let's see, the Black Prince to honored uh, reputation stops at honor when you kill mobs. What you do is, or what I did, is that's like really, really quick to get to honor. So you go to uh, Talon Steps, and you go to this place up here, uh, by the shore here. There's uh, one type of elite mob uh, that you can kill that summons like images. If you kill the images before the big mob, the images actually get your reputation. So you, from one mob, uh, without a guild standard you get 77 rep per elite with a guild standard you obviously get a bit more and uh, there are also like packs of five with uh, quillen or whatever the fuck they're called and that gives you rep not much but it's better than nothing okay so go here to farm your black prince rep uh, if you want to farm um, uh, Klaxi uh, you go to Zanvez or whatever you call it. Uh, here along the ridge here and there's a camp here or something. Like get a group of people like a guildies and just kill these mobs because they drop these uh, crystals, uh, red amber shards. You need 20 and when you turn 20 in here at Klaxivez you get uh, 275 rip per 20 shards. So that's cool. Uh, okay, so now to show you, I've been playing shitloads, actually not received everything I wanted, uh, but what I have received is this Shaw of Anger today, because the hotfix Shaw of Anger, uh, so you actually get an item from Shaw of Anger that gives you a quest, you turn it in, uh, in Town Long Steps, you get Reputation, uh, okay, I really like, uh, Reputation with Shadow Pan, uh, which you really need, and you get Boots, free epic boots. Like, why not? I mean, free epics. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Uh, so yeah, I got those. Uh, a, a, my guild master made uh, the chest, uh, epic chest. I bought these gloves on the auction house. Uh, I'm an engineer, so I made this head. And the first kill of Corin Diabrew got me this trinket. Now I've been looking around a lot to actually find, like the. A good combination you know a reforge so I'm happy with that uh, but like the combination of trinkets there's I mean no one really knows but I like this setup because I get a lot of hit and I don't have to sacrifice any crit, crit basically Um yeah the thing that would be better was, is to get like a one-hander and a the offhand from inscription the the, the jade the fang whatever fan what is it called? Fan. This one, uh, the inscribed jade fan. If you can get that with a one-hander, like a wand, dagger, whatever, you know, I would use that instead. But I, he can't make one because he doesn't. He, he, he doesn't have the mats for. It, so, yeah, uh, I managed to get 466 item level before raiding. Which, you know, I'm really happy with that, you know, I have my epics, I have heroic items, and yeah, I'm really happy with it. But, I'm still not sure if I want to play Fire or Frost, because, I mean, I really love Fire, but I played, played, I played Frost on the beta, and on the beta, I did, like, really nice DPS as Frost, uh, even with the terrible MS I had, and, uh, not really that much of knowledge to be honest. I didn't use Alter Time, for example. Um, but really, do some nice damage with PvP here in Looking for Ray. So I'm gonna try try it out tomorrow, see what works, and obviously 
adjust the talents. The talents I use right now are, yeah, I used to use Scorch. Now I'm gonna, I'm still gonna use Scorch on fights where I have to move a lot. Uh, but I'm gonna show you why it's presence of mind. Invocation is like really good. Um, yeah, the rune of power if you don't have to move too much. You can just warn if you take a lot of damage during the fight. So yeah, scorch if you have to move a lot. Ice flows. Yeah, actually using it for uh, actually using it for frost. It's it's actually pretty cool. So anyway, to <laughs> to what I actually want to show you guys. It's the opener of uh, this is for fire and for fire. Like what you want to do is to obviously do this. You know what you should do. You should uh, put up your living bomb because you get the debuff on the target. Uh, you should use your cooldowns. I mean, you should use um, personal cooldowns first of all. Like so, I have berserking, I have engineering, but I also have trinket and. I will always use the trinket first because I want like that big ignite at the start of the fight. So this trinket gives me over four thousand intellect. The gloves give me barely two thousand. So start with the trinket first. And uh, mirror images. I mean, you could pop them like before pull. They give us really small DPS boost, but better than nothing really. Um, yeah. And what I want to do is to. When you get your first healing up, you want to use Inferno Blast to trigger Hot Streak and pop Presence of Mind. And like optimal, like the optimal setup is to actually have Presence of Mind, Hot Streak, and a healing up at the same time, together with uh, like your personal cooldowns. It doesn't really matter, but uh, for Frost it matters. And when you have that, you use alter time why because alter time is fucking OP it's like the best fucking cooldown I've seen so far and um, alter time you know it takes a snapshot of you you know um, gives you back your health mana but it also gives you back buffs this means that the buff like at the start um, uh, um, presence of mind hot streak and heating up all of them will be back within six seconds, so you basically get <laughs> free pyro blasts. You have one from hot streak. You have another instant one from um, Prison of mind, and then you know ultra time triggers, and you have a new hot streak and a new instant from Prison of mind. You have four free uh, pyro blasts that are instant. Uh, only two of them do twenty five. Uh, 25% more damage, but doesn't matter. I mean, it's freaking awesome. So, let's see if I can actually do this because it's pretty late and I need to go to bed. But, uh, yeah, let's try this out. Okay, so let's. I'm, I'm not gonna use my mirror images, I can't parse. But I'm gonna use. Let's, let's use Lust for the heck of it, fast. Okay, so now Trinket. Okay, one, two, three, go. Nice lag there. Nope. There we go. Oh, and I totally screwed that up. Uh, instant pyro trigger. Go. Let's check our DPS. Not too bad. I reforge for raid right now. I haven't really. Yeah, I totally missed that one as well. I blame. It's late. I blame that. But I mean, that opener is just sick. And if you look at my previous video, like where I showed you like why I like fire, you actually notice that I don't actually use presence of mind. But I mean, the DPS in five minutes I actually managed to get with lower item level is like really awesome. So yeah, I'm I'm gonna try frost and fire tomorrow. See which one I like the most. And yeah, I mean we'll see. And my mana is gone, and I did not use invocation. But yeah, pretty fucking fail. But you know, you get the whole deal. Uh, obviously, uh, I've completely forgot about invocation. That's brilliant. Hmm. This is why I should not be up late. <laughs> okay, so obviously, always keep invocation up. I have 
And by the way, some people ask me about the um, the indicator for invocation. Okay, yeah, this one now it's pretty screwed up because I'm recording in the wrong resolution. But this is Power Wars, and the problem with this that I wanted to send people this, but it's not working because. Um, I don't know, I've been looking everywhere and the new Power Auras, I can't find any way to actually like copy Auras as you could do like in the old version. So I can't really, I can't send you, I mean I would like to send you guys the code but I can't because I can't find an option for it. So I've been looking around, I haven't been able to find anything, uh, any solution to it so, uh, but I, I can show you like what you do, you go into Power and uh, you go obviously you should be able to do all this already you go to display okay so the first one is uh, activation and activation you go to uh, buff debuff <laughs> buff debuff matches you, uh, you obviously it's a buff debuff you have to use that uh, buff debuff you click this button and here you add the name I use the um, spell uh, ID for it you can use whatever you want I use the spell ID uh, a unit player, you have some support triggers and shit. But I don't use that. Uh, there should be a, a buff player. Uh, where is that? Okay, so play a texture style. Okay, texture style. And you click use buff debuff texture so it actually shows the icon of the buff you have um, yeah then I added a timer add timer bar and you go to timer and you just I mean I don't know I, I changed nothing I just like add timer that's it so it's default everything and yeah that's I mean it's really easy to set up so uh, yeah and then you can just drag it wherever you want like left click, uh, control left click, drag, drag it wherever you want, wherever you want it to show up. So yeah, guys, that's it. Uh, I will be posting raid videos when we get some kills. Um, yeah, I can't wait to raid. You know, I've been, I capped my valor on. Oh my god, I think I capped my valor on Friday, last week. Justice points been capped for fucking ages. Uh, I had three Elder Charms. I killed uh, Shard of Anger two times and Galleon one time. Uh, used a charm for all of them. Got nothing. I mean, I got I received no loot whatsoever from those kills. Uh, obviously, you don't get. It's a weekly thing, but I even used a charm and I got gold. It's like what the hell. Yeah, that sucks. But tomorrow I'm gonna turn it in. It's a weekly quest, so I'm gonna turn it in because I have <sighs> I have 197 lesser charms. <laughs> yeah, doing daily much and uh, not at all. Okay, so yeah, guys, that's it. Uh, I'll see you. Uh, oh well, you'll see me in the next videos, raiding and hopefully killing a boss. So. Uh, yeah guys, uh, take care, I'm gonna go to bed, and thanks for watching, see you later.